Okay, kidney again, right? Right, because you could see glomeruli. You could see circular open areas, tubules surrounding the glomeruli. You could see large blood vessels. And uh, your sense that this is not a totally normal kidney, other than the fact that it's being showed in pathology lab, is reinforced by the fact that you could see areas of here, 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 kind of disrupting the kidneys. And you suspect, because they look like they're cellular infiltrates, you're thinking infection or at least inflammation and sure you have some little abscesses here let's go in a little bit closer well besides the fact that you see neutrophils and maybe some fibrin if you look around not for too much longer you can also see that there are like little spherules filled with little balls and because they are kind of red and this is a PAS stain you already know these are fungi. Could we find another one? We certainly can. Here's another one over here. It looks like we have uh, spherules uh, filled with little balls or if you'd rather use the term endospores you can and in some areas it looks like these endospores are free within the abscess and in some areas it looks like they're still being held together by their little sac or endospore. Uh, somebody was nice enough to draw little arrows as well showing all of these endospores within the spherule and somebody was nice enough to draw the individual little spherules that have been released from the endospores as well and here's an area where you have both uh, endospores within a spherule and free. This uh, fungus which does this is um, coccidiomycosis classically looks like this and rather than think of a million different fungi and why does this have to be coccidio, just remember one thing the three major systemic fungi which infect not only the lung but many other areas of the body are histo, blasto, and coccidio. Histoplasmosis, blastomycosis, and coccidiomycosis. So basically, you've got a severe systemic fungal infection. Most likely it's going to be one of those three. And this is the only three that shows uh, endospores released uh, um, by the spherules. Thank you very much.